this empty town I'm searching for the lost and found But you don't care, you're unaware Keep moving like the scars aren't even there It's in the air, like a blazing flare
Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the TF Dream Lower Bracket Final. Today we have Eternity versus Control. It's going to be a very interesting match today because the winner of this match will move on to the next round. So basically, the round has started here. Both teams are now spawned in. TR is actually pulling this flag right now for Control. Control is going to be on red team and Eternity is going to be on blue. So on Eternity, we have LBJ6, Avetis, Rix, Semigrand, and Tropkillas. And on Control, we have Do, Sun, I exclusive, TOR, Alpha, Afla, and What About the Face? Interesting match today. Both teams are actually pulling the flag. We're at a standoff basically less than a minute into the round. But with overdrives, that probably isn't going to last very long. Rix gets destroyed really quickly. Not going to use his Viking overdrive, saving it for the next spawn. Trop Killers with that Hunter overdrive pushing in to Control's base right now. He needs to take out Tor before he can really do anything. Tor with that nice Firebird damage. Trop Killers uses his repair pretty early on. Great shot by Vettis with that Hornet overdrive from across the map. He's trying to get some nice shots there. Avetis is right next to this repair and doesn't really look like he can do much. His supplies run out and Tor is going to take him out. Rick's coming from behind now. He does have his overdrive. Maybe he can do something with this. Exclusive is protecting with the Hunter overdrive as well. Rick's uh, gets taken out by I Exclusive's overdrive. Trop Kill is pushing in as well. He has Hunter overdrive. Maybe he can get it off before. Nope, he's going to get destroyed. Tor, meanwhile, in Eternity's base right now, but he does get taken out. Both teams don't the standoff. Overdrives were used, so both teams don't really have any overdrives right now. Maybe Rix can use this to advantage his advantage, push in to Control's base, and use his overdrive. He needs to take out what about the face, though, so he doesn't do too much damage to him. Good. Oh, welcome, Seal. Hello, guys. Seal this side. And uh, this would be a very interesting match, isn't it, Tatsun? Yeah, so far, both teams just have a standoff going on. But like I said, with overdrives in the mix, it's probably not going to last for too much longer. That's right. Right now, Rix is pushing in with his Viking overdrive. He's had that for about two, one to two minutes now. He probably needs to get it off before he's basically wasting time with his overdrives. Some Grand is also pushing with Rix as well. Some Grand's already super low, though. It doesn't look like he's going to do much. Rix only has double drops right now he uses to repair pretty early he's just focusing on defending right now um do LBJ, sitting in his face lbj6 goes towards the right side uh, he doesn't see anyone doesn't notice tor alpha he also has an overdrive so uh, good focus from avities yeah venus with that hornet overdrive very deadly with magnum it's basically one shot anywhere um Avetis is going to get taken out and exclusive is pushing in lbj6 doesn't notice him Pair. Doesn't look like it's going to help Ooh, much. I think there. Exclusive might be able to return this flag. Um, no. What? Why didn't what? he just return it? Oh my gosh. All right. Well, Do is being attacked right now by Trop Killers, but Trop Killers does get taken out. That was uh, weird. I don't know why Exclusive didn't just return it. I wonder why he was waiting there. I thought um, he was just wanted to stop for AVTs to just focus on. Or making his one of the shots, but it didn't happen. AVT stopped there, and uh, because of his good gameplay, they were able to protect the flag. Mm -hmm. Chop Killers and Ricks are basically the only guys going for this return right now, and Ricks just can't get his overdrive off in time. He's just getting destroyed before he even gets over to the blue flag. Do you should drop the flag for exclusive? Nope, he doesn't. And he was going to just stay there. If he's pushing towards the right side, everyone's focusing him. Stay going to Yep. Rick's pushing in again. He needs to get this overdrive off. He's just wasting time that he could be using a new overdrive. Um, he's out of repair here. He's going to have help from Marcos, though. Dude doesn't have double armor here, so Trop Killers. Okay, here's the return Ooh, that we were yep. waiting for. And the first capture from Sam Grant. Yep, Eternity is winning 1-0 now. Um, like we said earlier, there's going to be 10 rounds today. So, very interesting. It's going to be a long day, and unless one team wins six in a row, which will be um, highly unlikely based on the teams we have today. Avetis was actually pulling the flag there. Exclusive is going to use his overdrive, and they're going to be able to get the return. 
Yep, Sun returns the flag right now. Exclusive pulling the flag towards the right side. Riggs blocking him. He's waiting for his teammates to come. Mariko is pushing from back. Someone needs to help Exclusive or else it's going to be written from Mariko, which it is. Yeah. Um, Vettis just kind of sitting in the base right here. Misses that shot on tour and looks like Dew is going to get that return. Um, Rick's pushing in once again. He's going to go for that repair, take it from what about. He uses his repair and he gets that drop. Um, Vettis has his Hunter or Hornet overdrive. He's going to start pushing from the right side where no one's really going to notice him. As long as he can hit his shots here, this could be a um, successful push. Yep, good, good focus from Evites. Just removing Dew from that. Sam Grant pulling the flag towards the center, towards Shrop Killers, but Space returns the flag. Yeah, Vulcan is actually really good right now, especially when I exclusive got the kill on the red base flag for a second there. He did a lot of damage super quickly. Sun is kind of defending with his Hornet Overdrive here. He notices Avetis coming to the right side of red base. Oh, wait, does he? I don't even know. Vettis just got his double armor off. He, if he can get out of the base, he can probably get a pull. Yeah. Oh, he's going to get hit Sam a Grant lot, coming though. He should drop a bomb, Sam Grant. No, oh, wow. Grant. Sun gets taken off, out from basically across the map. And now Sam Grant's going to be pulling the flag into Eternity's base already. Sam Grant should come towards the standoff position. They should take face out. On the other side, we see... Sun towards the left side. He should drop the flag to someone. Yeah, he's going to. Maybe. Well, he has his Hornet Overdrive. If he can get a nice shot off here, he's going to do basically damage to all of them. Oh, he has a perfect angle. Oh, what? His doesn't look like his shot did much damage there. Oh, wow. Avetis almost got that return. Yeah, but Sun with that Overdrive. And I think Face, one of their members, lagged out. So they're just playing five. Controller playing with five players right now until face comes back. Um, Tor Alpha holding the flag. He's going to be pushed by Chop Grand, and that's going to be the return for Eternity. Eternity's going to be able to get the second flag capture about eight minutes into the first round. Yeah. Yeah. Based on face how Control back. played, yeah. Based on how Control played yesterday, you know, I'm surprised they're losing this round right now. It's just a start, a long way to go. They can still make a comeback. Yeah, there's 10 rounds. So anything can happen. Yeah. Good start from Eternity, though. Maybe Trop Killers might be able to pull this one more time. Ooh, He's going to be taken out, but yeah, the Vettis is pushing from the left. No one really notices him. The Vettis is going to grab this flag now and start pushing his way towards his own base. Hmm. Exclusive has Hunter Overdrive, but he's not going to be able to really make it over there. Avetis now in Eternity's base, and he just needs to get across this little road here. He does, and that looks like it's going to be the third capture for Eternity. Yep, only a minute and a half, and I'm pretty sure that this round goes to Eternity. Yeah, almost certain there. Um, Tor pushing in right now, along with Face. Tor is going to use his Wasp Overdrive, but Marcos is going to get, get taken out either way. Um, maybe they can get one flag capture here, kind of just show that they can get a capture here. And it looks like he will. Yep. There we go. Good cap by Control. 50 seconds so, left. Yeah. And I think Face and Exclusive will try to make one more push. But there's Avetis with his overdrive, so all pushes exclusive, will be nullified. Yeah, exclusive, ha exclusive has the Hunter overdrive. He's going to be taken out by Chop Killers super, super fast. Chop Killers just sitting defending. They don't really need to do much here. They do have the flag lead, which means you know they're going to win the round. Exclusive pushing in once again. 20 seconds left to go. It's pretty much impossible at this point. It is impossible to get two flag caps. <laughs> Yeah, they're kind of just driving around. They know they have the round victory. Ten seconds left, and that's basically going to be it. Yep, so first round goes to Eternity. Well played. Yeah, and we can go are ahead we and... opening the pump? 
yeah, we can go ahead and open the form now, guys. Um, it's going to be open for about two minutes here. Good luck. Go ahead and go down to the description. Put your name below, and we'll pick the winners after next round. Yep. All right, so cool. Round one is over, and teams are going to be switching sides. Maybe control, you know, get their round win and be tied up for the first map. Mm -hmm. um, based on this map, a lot of people say it is a uh, map or, you know, different sided depending on what side you're on. Um, I don't really know personally what side is best, but, you know, that's what I've heard. So maybe control can utilize their being on blue side to get the round victory. Yeah, pretty much like if if tankers can use the over uh, drugs, I mean, then it the base really doesn't matter a lot. Uh, they're usually it matters when it's only drop control that you have to do. So yeah, I don't know. Maybe control or attorney is going to be switching out a member here. Um, I don't really know yet. There's still a minute until round two is going to be starting here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so guys, what do you see? Oh, you were there for yesterday's match, uh, right? No, I wasn't. Oh well, did, you, was a... did you see it? No, I didn't. Well, guys, yesterday Team Pointers actually won against Control, so that's the reason I was saying Control. I am pretty sure they were gonna do really well today. I am sure they're gonna do really well today because yesterday when they versed Team Pointers, they actually did. Pretty... It was only a two round loss, and they played really well yesterday. So maybe oh, they I know play. that part, but like, I didn't know. I didn't watch no. the entire game. <laughs> no, you're good. I was just trying to bring that up. No. 30 seconds here until round two is going to be starting. Um, We don't know the prize for each question yet. Um, But yeah, they're going to be good. These are the final prizes are increased, which means, you know, one of these questions may have five containers in them. One of them may have five golds. It all depends on um, what question it is. It's all random, too. Um, mm -hmm. All right, so there we go. Round two is going to be starting. Both teams um, are now spawning in. Attorney's on red base, and control is blue. Rick's pushing towards the left side with Sam Grand and Drop Killers. Oh, Drop Killers pushing towards the right. I think Alpha might be able to pull this. Hmm. Some grand pulling the flag right now. He has help from Rick's just blocking all of Control's teammates. He needs to get out of I exclusive's range of that Vulcan, and he does. He's not going to help have help from both LBJ and Chop Kill is defending. This looks like one a zero for eternity. Capture. Yeah, within thirty seconds. Oof, that's hard. Well, fast capture there. Um, exclusive pushing in. He has help from. Tor and Sun, well, big push coming from Control here. Three members of Control are now in Attorney's base. What about the face? It has full supplies, and he's just going to get across the map now. Yeah, I think uh, counter capture can be possible if Rix and Tropical is taken out. No, oh, Rix is going to use that Viking Overdrive. Takes out Do and Exclusive, and now he's just going to be... Pulling the flag here, and now it's going to be a stalemate for both teams. Ooh. Good focus that from Rex. He drops the flag for Sam Grant. Oh, wow. Lag. Can this be a return? Avetis is getting some great shots over here. Maybe he can do the return, and he does. What about and the face? He does. Oh. Lagged out. Yeah. Oh, never mind. Glitched. My bad. Well, there we go. Two flag captures in under two minutes for Eternity. Great job by them. They're doing great on this map. A 2 0 within two minutes. Still eight mm -hmm. minutes left. And uh, I think Control needs to just make good attacks now. Face pulling the flag one more time. After that behind him. Yeah, there's no one there to contest. What about the face? Oh, wow. Rix is actually pulling Control's flag as well. He has help from Trop Killers right now. And it looks like it's going to be a yet another stalemate. Ooh, great overdrive from LBJ. <laughs> great overdrive LBJ, yep. Just using... I think four tankers got that overdrive. Mm -hmm. Now Vettis is going to have his Hornet overdrive. 
right? Oh, what? He shoots the, what? Okay, I guess he didn't shoot the wall there. That was a little spectator yeah. glitch. Avetis going to take out Dew in one shot. Sun is and... the only one holding the flag, and there's going to be a All return. Right. Third gap, though. Definitely. Wow. Rix is pulling the flag again. No one there to contest him. Wow. <laughs> Trinity is uh, just dominating this round. Yeah, they have com almost complete map control here. At least they have control where it matters. No. Exclusive is going to get taken out by Trop Killer's Hunter Overdrive. And now Rix is just going to start moving across towards the flag. Tor is the only one there to defend. No. Um, After it's taken out, out, and Trop Killer's will capture them. Whoa, wait, what's going what? on? Did someone log out? Oh. I'm just confused here. <laughs> yeah, what, what is happening with Exclusive? Wow, there's some huge lag going on right now. I don't know. Um, wait, did they cap? They did cap that third flag. What is going on? Like, I don't. Even That's just three zero for me. Alright, now, okay. now three one. Sun captures this flag or do? I'm um, all right. I guess three one now. That was a trip, definitely. <laughs> definitely. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I, I think they may, with... if it may just be our side. If not, they're going to have exclusive reset here. If it's not um, just our side, they're going to definitely, he's going to definitely have to be reset. Hopefully it's just our side and exclusive is acting normal for the enemy team. Oh, speaking of enemy team, Tor has the flag right now to controls base. And it looks like the second flag capture is going to happen here. And it will. It's now 2-3 for control. Just one flag away. From tying it up here. <laughs> Wasp bomb no, goes it, off here. Same thing is happening with me. Uh, Rick's pulling the flag towards the left side from his face, and uh, almost the entire red team is just blocking right side. Mm -hmm. Top killers is there to defend, but now there's three members of control pushing in. Wow, they're basically all one shot now. Um, some server lag there, but looks like Tor is going to be taken out by Chop Killers. Going to get the return, but here, wow, good job by Dew getting that return. Mm -hmm. And looks like both teams are going to be making a push again. Avetis is pushing in versus I Exclusive. Exclusive has his Hunter Overdrive, but it looks like he's going to save it until it's more beneficial. He, he does use it on Avetis. Yeah, and he Rick's will hit Ricks. Will be able to pull this flag, or oh. he'll drop it for some grand. Some lag there. Oh wow! What about the face? Is pulling right now? His over his supplies are going to run out here, but he's going to be able to take out a Vetus before he can get another shot off. And it looks like here another like another stalemate again. This is like the third this match. But like I, like I said last round, with overdrives, it shouldn't last long. There's about four minutes left here, and Control still needs to get one flag to at least tie it up on the first map. Um, Rick's still holding this flag. He has help from LGA6, who has his overdrive. He's probably going to wait to use it. Um, yeah, he's going to wait for some grant. Never mind. Why would he wait? Oh, I guess he was. Some grant's going to get that overdrive now. Um, what about the face pushing in right now? They need to take him out because he does have this Viking overdrive. Oh, wow, he's going to use it here. Dude's okay. going to just stay towards the left side. Uh, I think he should probably try to aim for Semgran. Semgran just... Run around the house. That out. <laughs> Good job by him. Um, Tor pushing in to take out Semgran. He has help from Rix and LVJ6 again. Ooh, great bomb by Semgran. Doesn't really take out Tor, but it would have. Yeah. And Sun coming towards the left side. I think this can be a return. Oh, Trop Killers gets no one with that Hunter Overdrive. Ooh, Sun hits the wall there. Trop Killers is going to need some help from his teammates. Looks like no one notices Tor. I think they, they... Wow, what a, what a good use of exclusive. And then do capture. So 3-3 three, three now. Good well, comeback. Yeah, definitely. Controls doing what they, you know, what they need to. They're able to make sure that Eternity doesn't get map control again. 
and it's definitely working off, paying off at least. Some grand pushing in with Ricks and Chop Killers. Some grand's gonna be taking out Chop left. Some takes out exclusive, but it looks like Chop Killers still be taking out. What about the face pulling the fuck? Can this be a fourth capture? He's wow. been the MVP what for this round. What about the face? Has basically gotten three flag caps here. He's been doing a great job. Oh, um, what a comeback! Right now. Oh, I'm the vet is pulling yeah. the flag with help from Rix. And can this be a fourth capture? I think it can be. Rix will take the flag. There's no one pushing from blue side. So four four. A minute and a half left, and anyone's game. Yeah. Do switch from Thunder to Gauss. Um, Avet is pushing in again. He doesn't have his overdrive here or double armor. He's going to try and shoot Do, but doesn't really make much of an impact. Do's going to take out Avetis and get that return. Okay, so both teams kind of defending a little bit. Um, Control is actually pushing with three members. Tor is going to be taken out. And then what about the face with his Viking overdrive? Chop Killers needs to get close. But he's not going to be close enough to get his Hunter Overdrive off. Um, what about the face? Still there. They need to take him out. Oh, okay. Tor Alpha. No one's going to notice him. Oh, wait. Never mind. Chop Killers. Kill yeah. And he's going to just kill him. Sam Grant pulling the flag towards the center. 40 seconds left. Someone needs to help him. Rix should help him. Ooh, son. Someone great to... shots off. Oh, help Rix, everyone. Ooh, oh, nice. Rick. Nice shot from LBJ. Oh my gosh, Sun just taking out everyone. <laughs> Tor Alpha pushing in. He has triple drops here. He's going to get his wasp. Oh, he doesn't get his wasp bomb off. Both teams going to get the return. 15 seconds left. Neither team can cap here. So it's going to be a tied round for, exclusive, or for control and eternity, which makes it 1-0 for the first map. Cool. Round two over. Let's go ahead and pick the winners for form number one. So we can open form two. Mm -hmm. Do you know what's the next map? Um, I don't, but if it's sandbox matchmaking, that'll be fun. So that'll be a quick. Yeah. I've I i have not seen control play in sandbox, but eternity. When they played in sandbox, they absolutely destroyed. All right, so the winners of form number one are Signal, Best Smokey. Wow, two names that I've seen a lot. Congrats to you guys, always being active. And Scorpion, Scorpion Horizon. All right, congrats. Let's go ahead and open form number two. You guys have two minutes. All right, so next map is Kuba. Hmm, that would be an interesting one. Yeah, Gubaka, I haven't really seen it much besides in this tournament. Um, it's definitely been utilized a lot. A lot more than, you know, but I've usually seen it. Uh -huh. It's always kind of fun to see those maps, you know, the maps that have a bunch of crazy angles and that have, like, dope structures in the middle. It's kind of just fun to see how the dynamic works between both teams and those type of maps. So we should be receiving, should, we should be getting the map link. But yeah, based on the first two rounds, it's her. Um, if they win the next four, I think, yeah, if they win the next four, they'll be moving on. Of course, you know, it's saying a lot, winning the next four in a row. It's kind of hard, but now we have um, the link and we'll be jumping into round three momentarily. Yep. It might take a while because they have to reset and all. But guys, if you have any questions for us, let us know. I see people saying that same people win. Guys, it's not that we choose winners. It's random. It's just they're here almost every stream and they're putting their name in every single form, which means, you know, they're going to have higher chances of winning just because they're entering a lot more often. Mm -hmm. October is here, which means Halloween event is going to be coming soon, guys. Just in a, um, two or three weeks. I'm excited. Halloween is always 
favorite time in Tanky? Yeah, a lot of cool prizes. Mm -hmm. Maybe they'll bring good back the OG Halloween map, but you never know. Yeah. Right. Signal one again, <laughs> guys. Chill. <laughs> yeah, I see Signal in here all the time. He's in. Guys, he's bound to win a few, you know. There's only around 40 to 50 people entering the form, anyways, guys. Like a 2 to 3% chance of winning almost every single form you enter. Which means if you enter in all five forms, you basically have like a 20% chance of winning for the day. And there will be a lot more uh, rounds now, so and Signal can win the other giveaways. So just stick with us, guys. Enter your name in rest of the forum, and hopefully you win. Teams have yet to reset here. Um, the faster they reset, the faster we can get on three. Hopefully they reset soon. Looks like they're starting to reset. Which means about two minutes until round three starts, guys. Alright. Both teams almost about reset. Um, two members left on each side. All right, LBJ's the last guy here. Can he go ahead and leave so we can match? And he self-destructs for some reason. <laughs> <laughs> Instead of leaving, he's, uh, you know, pushing time. Starting the game. Starting the game alone. <laughs> All right, there we go. He leaves. And now it's official restart. Two minutes exactly until round three finally starts. Um, let's see if there's any team roster changes. I'm guessing it's going to be the same because Eternity, especially in this tournament, haven't really been switching their members up a lot. They usually stick with the same five. They they can switch one guy in here or there, but based on the last rounds, they've been using about the same guys. So right now they're doing the typical Asita trick, getting their Dictator to have his overdrive by the time the round starts. Typically, you see this every single game. Just kind of funny to watch, I guess. There's people Marcus. asking that you haven't been posting your videos lately. Oh, it's just, you know, it's hard to get content, not going to lie. <laughs> you know, when special events come out, it's pretty fun. Yeah. Halloween events coming out, guys, so, you know, everyone, everyone will be playing that. So maybe, you know, everyone will enjoy that. It'll be fun. Get some content. Um, we have, I think, another tournament coming up in a week or two. Um, usually, it'll be like another a TOF tournament or something. But yeah, 30 seconds here until round three begins. Dictator doesn't have his overdrive yet. Either that or I'm lagging. How come Afla has the over? Looks like Rick's lagged oh, out. Oh, did he That's take the overdrive? I'm not sure. Still six people on control side. One of them's going to leave. Let's see who it is. All right, looks like the same team. But yeah, yeah, it looks like the same team. All right, cool. Round three is started here. Now I'll be bored, and both teams are going to be attacking. Toward AVJ pushing, is pushing. Yeah. yeah. AVJ is pushing towards the right side. Sorry, my man. Uh, no, you're and good. He, he's just staying there because Sun oh, and Dew just uh, focusing him pretty well. Yeah, exclusive Sun. Both have their overdrives ready. Sun's overdrive is going to be running out pretty soon here. He gets a great cross map shot on LBJ6. Exclusive pushing in now. He has no one there to contest him. Sun Grand has that shaft, though. So, uh, what? Okay, he got a what about the face got a great double kill here. 
Ooh, LBJ Ooh, uses was... his Viking. The flag didn't drop off, though, so what about the face is going to have to go up again? Great job from Control, just keeping constant pressure on Eternity right now. Can this be a cap? Very close. And you will capture the flag. Mm -hmm. So 1-0 for Control. Yeah, Control just kept attacking every single time they spawned in, keeping the pressure on Eternity, and it worked out. They got the first flag capture of round three. Good job by them. Chop Kill has tried to use his Hunter Overdrive there, but it even. Um, Sun pushing in. He has his Hornet again. Wow, this is almost the third time this match. I think it is the third time. He's just getting kills left and right. Avetis has actually switched. He switched to Railgun here. Don't know if that was the best decision, but wow. Sun pulling the flag down. Ooh, nice shot. Someone flipped yes. him. He has flipped there. He has due to help him, and there's basically no one from Eternity there to contest. And that's going to be basically the second flag capture for Control. I don't know why Dew just went the long way. Um, maybe that's going to affect it. Doesn't look like it will, and Dew's going to get that second flag capture. Everyone's focusing on Miracle right now. Drop Killers was coming, but he was focused from Sun. Mm hmm. Avetis didn't one shot do with that railgun. That's that, that's why railgun isn't the best because it can't one shot like Magnum. I don't know if Avetis will switch back here soon, but now both Sun and what about the face pushing right now? And he does. He does. Avetis just switched his combo. Yeah, I think I think he realized that railgun wasn't wasn't the right play. Mm -hmm. There we go. He has Magnum again. All right, Chop Killers and Marcos both there to hopefully take out Sun before he can get, pull that flag any further. Marcos's free shot doesn't go off in time. Sun, okay, there we go. There's the free shot, and Sun's gonna get taken out. Exclusive pushing towards Sam Grand, or Sam Grand drops the bomb. Um, exclusive here. He has his hunter. Looks like he's just trying to do some damage on Eternity's base right now. Still 2 of lead for Control. Eternity's going to need to do at least tie the round. LBJ6. Oh my gosh, Avetis flipped himself. All right, I guess it's just LBJ6. Takes out Dew with his Viking Overdrive. Um, he has no help from his team here. So as long as they just realize he's there, LBJ6 is going to be taken out. LBJ6 trying to um, push towards their own base, but there's no help from red team. Oh, and Vettis misses that shot you... on what about the face. Well, they're just doing single pushes here right now. Eternity needs to get the team play together on this map. All right, LBJ6 pushing in by himself. No one's going to be noticing yet from Control. Exclusive is basically out. the only one. Ooh, LBJ6 just jumps over Exclusive, takes him out, and now he's going to be making it across the map. LBJ6 runs out of double armor. He has toy and... Oh, what about the face is going to get that return? Great overdrive from what about the face getting... Um, both LBJ6 and Marcos taken out and getting that return. Well, wow, Sun is just sitting in Eternity's base right now. Or he's lagged out, I can't tell. Oh, never mind. I guess he just has the shaft glitch. Okay, Vettis has his Hornet Overdrive. Once again, no one to help him attack. Not what you want to see. LBG6, hopefully he can spawn in. Oh, he spawns in the backside. Okay, Vettis takes out Tor. Now he just has to worry about exclusive. Marcos needs to help him out. Oh, Vettis runs out of his overdrive. Ooh, great job by LB6 blocking. He's going to grab this flag, and now he's hopefully going to get the flag capture. I don't know. 
Um, yeah, he does. Good job by Eternity, even though it was a single. Um, Avetis knew what he was doing, and LBJ6 was there to help. Sun and exclusive pushing towards the left side. Yeah, Sun is his overdrive here. Um, so is Marcos, though. If everyone groups up, he can give everyone the overdrive. Oh, exclusive uses his hunter. Suns will be able to take this flag here without with little retaliation. Chop killers notices him. Ooh, he's gonna get taken out by the rest of control. Good team play there. LBJ6 has his overdrive, but Dew's gonna be blocking. And there we go. Sun is in his own base. And it looks like he's gonna get that cap. And he does. Chop Killers and Marcos both pushing. Marcos notices Chop Killers can't make it. So he pushes back to hopefully use his Dictator Overdrive. He does. Oh my gosh. They just got destroyed by Sun there. Sun is doing a great job for Control right now. Um, Do actually lagged out. He's going to join back pretty quickly. Avet is pushing in. Maybe he'll have his Overdrive to take out Sun. He does not yet. He needs to two-shot Sun if he wants to do anything here. Okay, Sun is taken out now. Avetis doesn't have a repair. So he's going to need help from both Semgrin and... Okay, well, Eternity has basic, basically total map control right now. Dew is the only one they need Ooh, to take Dew care Dew is the only one. He might be able to return this. Ooh, Semgrin drops the bomb. Okay, good bomb, good bomb. Mayakos will pull this flag and hopefully it's a second capture. Well, almost every single person from each side was taken out. The exact same time, and now both teams spawned in. Wow, Wait, big server what lag. Happened? What happened? Ooh, I think Face could have okay. returned that flag. That's <laughs> so unfortunate for Eternity. That would have been such an easy capture. Oh no, hopefully they can still get the cap, or else that would absolutely be dreadful. Okay, it looks like they will. I would have felt so bad if they didn't get that capture there because of the server lag. All right. LBJ6 pushing in with some grand. Okay, some grand self destructed. Sun once again getting shots off. Wow, he's doing a great job for control right now. He's just taking out everyone with that Hornet overdrive. Some grand gets taken out by what about the face here? No one there to defend. And what about the face still has his overdrive to be able to. Ooh, exclusive gets his Hunter overdrive off as well. And there we go. Looks like it's going to be the fourth capture. For control. I exclusive pushing in once again. I, I, oh my gosh, Eternity is having a lot of trouble keeping map control. They're basically limited to their own base right now. Control's doing a great job at making sure once they spawn in, they're taken out. Wait, Eternity won first two rounds, right? In Barda? Um, they won the first, tied the second round. Yeah. So it's 1-0 lead right now for Eternity. So Control's probably going to win the second round, so it's going to be 1-1 one, one, one tie for both teams. Maybe Eternity can assess what they did wrong this round and you know fix what they need to for the next round. You never know. This The, the differences on the map are kind of bigger than the typical map. So maybe this is map sided or team sided, but we'll see for we'll see next round. Afla pulling the flag, but Marcos might be able to return this. And ten seconds left. AVP's pulling the flag. Yeah. Five uh, seconds. He, he doesn't have enough time. Yeah. Either way, four seconds left. Three, and there we go. Round three is going to go to control. Great job by them, and now it's going to be tied up. Let's go ahead and pick the winners for our form number two. I apologize, guys, if my voice is a little bit nasally. I do have a cold right now. But yeah, it looks like the winners of form number two are up on your screen right now. They are Pokey971, I, Legendary Warrior, I. Wow, two. I've seen a lot in streams again. Good job to you guys. And Virtue as the third winner. So congrats to you three. Let's go ahead and pull up form number three. You have two minutes to answer, or you two minutes to open the form in the description, put your name. I'm starting now. 
I don't know. Um, hopefully, this time, Eternity changes their tactics or do something different. Yeah, they just... They had map control for, like, one flag. But besides yeah. that, Control just did a great job at making sure they had almost every single corner taken care of. I think, initially, they also had, like, wrong turrets. Especially because LBJ was playing with Shaft uh, initially. Mm, Avetis was playing with Railgun. Yeah, that was just unfortunate. They should have stuck with what they knew. I don't know why they switched turrets to begin with. It is what it is. Um, did they get a technical pause? I think there may have been a technical pause. Just based on what the spectator said. Hopefully not, because that'll be boring for us. <laughs> um, I guess we'll see when the 30 seconds go down. <laughs> Both teams, of course, getting their overdrives like normal. Actually, they aren't. Yeah, I think there is a technical pause. I'm not sure. Hmm. So guys, quick round recap. Um, Eternity played really well, and on this second map, I don't know. They weren't able to keep map control for the first half of this map. So it'll be interesting to see what they do this round. You know, make sure get their spawns down, um, defend the corners that they need to defend. Oh yes, so it is a technical pause. But yeah, they need to defend, like, basically perfectly here. This side, they have a bit more protection, and they have, from their base, there's a bit, there's a little bit more sight lines from blue base, so maybe that'll help them in the long run. Um, but maybe they'll be able to get this round two, or the map two, round two victory. So we have a technical pause until 51. So which means, I don't really know, I guess we can go ahead and pick the winners for form number three when the minutes end. Um, yeah, I guess we can pick the winners for form three real quick while we're waiting. Yep, we can wait a second um, to pick it real quick so we can wait for our um, broadcaster to get the list. I'll go ahead and get the list for you. All right, there we go. 43 of you guys um, entered. Good luck. Once, like normal, there's three winners, guys. And if you enter every single form, if there's only about 40 people, um, you guys have a really good chance. If you enter every form, it's about 15 to 20% chance of winning for the day, which is actually pretty high. And if you can, if you continue to come to these streams, we have them almost every day. You guys have a really good chance of getting a promo code. Like like I've said, I've seen these typical names in here almost every single stream. But yeah, can, good job to them. Oh wow, okay. So the winners are Control. That's kind of funny because Control is playing. Uh, the team is um, um, Ra Rayuzia. Congrats to the second winner. And BRBR underscore Tinker24. Congrats to you three. Um, good job. Hopefully both teams are going to be um, selfing and re-entering here soon, so you know I have something to talk about. Because I'll be honest, these technical pauses, there's not really much to say. Um, I guess I could talk about the previous event that Tinky had. That was pretty fun. Um, Hopper Hole is now officially in the garage, if you guys want to go ahead and buy that. It's pretty cheap so far, you know. Um, MK1, if you guys just want to try it out in parkour or something, MK1 is like 500 crystals or something. It's pretty cool. If you really just want to try it out, you know, just go ahead and buy it. Hop in parkour. It's pretty easy. Or, you know, there's always YouTube videos from people like Jay Tanky. Um, they, also, they also have some nice tutorials. If you guys are looking for a new hole and you want to see is it worth it, um, you can always check out some YouTube videos by the Tanky, or tanky YouTubers. Um, but yeah, it's a pretty cool hole. Um, it has its own unique ability. You can hop, of course. I'm sure you guys all played the limited time event where you can hop around. That was pretty fun. Uh, but yeah, it's a cool new hole. I'm sure they'll add a new one. It was actually compared to Ares release. 
Aries took around two years to release, and this one took around a month. It's definitely a good job by Tanky, getting a hole out pretty quickly. Okay, both teams now resetting. I'm just waiting for Misery and Sun to reset. Hopefully they leave soon. Come on, guys, reset for me. Uh, there's nothing to talk about. Please. Okay, looks like they're just sitting by themselves, having a doozy of a time. Unfortunate for me. Uh, all right, let's see what they're doing. Okay, sun left. Now I'm just waiting for Misser. Please, Misser, leave. Do it now. Okay, there we go. All teams have left. And now restart's going to happen. There we go. Two minutes now until round four is going to begin. Um, so hopefully I won't be, you know, saying basically nothing. Guys, go ahead and ask me some questions in the chat so I'm not waiting a full two minutes by randomly. Um, who do you think is going to win Eternity or Control? Well, based on the past three rounds, both teams are doing really well. Eternity did really good on the first map, and so if maybe they're going to tie it up, and it'll be a tied 1-1 at the end of this, which means there will be another six rounds. Jeez, six rounds, that's a lot to say. But it's definitely going to be a longer stream. Both teams are doing pretty, I mean, they're, they're both doing pretty much the same here. Both performing pretty well in their own respective maps. But yeah, if I had to say who'd win, I know a lot more people in Eternity. At least I've seen their name. So I'd like to think Eternity has a better chance, but yeah, Control's also doing really well. They did really well yesterday against Team Pointers. They're doing pretty good today against Eternity. All right, 50 seconds left until round four begins. Um, what do you think is the weakest hole plus turret combination? Weakest, you know, Wasp, of course, that's the least amount of health on a hole. So Wasp and then Twins, because, you know, no one really uses Twins on Wasp. So, yeah, that's my weakest combo. Um, how, What do you think about esports matches right now? Um, We did take a break um, about a week ago just because there, a lot of us were just starting school. And, you know, it's hard to get stuff organized together. But, yeah, we're back. Hopefully. Esports matches are going to be continuing, and they're going to be constant because you know we like to bring you guys more content. Because you know the more content we bring you guys, the more interested you in the game, which you guys are going to enjoy the game longer, and you're going to stay longer. But yeah, so that's what I think about esports matches in the future. We're going to have a lot more, and they're going to be a lot, a lot of fun. All right, cool. Round four has started here. Both teams spawned in. We have Eternity on blue, and can't. Not can't stop. Control, my bad. Control is on red here. So it's going to be interesting. Control did a great job at map control when they were on the red team. Maybe they can do, or when they were on the blue team, maybe they have just as good map control when they're on the red team. Do doing a great job of defending. He gets taken out by Ricks now. Ricks pulling this flag. He's going to have, yeah, Vettis and Trop Killers doing it. Oh my gosh, what the heck. Sun, great shot from Sun there. Wow, basically cross map midair. Avetis notices the flag. He's going to need to grab it. He does. Oh my gosh. What about the face? Gets a great shot off of Vettis as well. And there we go. Dude's going to get that return. Um, Y'all go to school? Yes, I am in college. Okay, Sun grabs the flag from Eternity. Wow, there's no one there. Sun's just going to just be able... Okay, Sun runs into the wall. That's not what we want to see. Okay, never mind. Sun gets taken out by Trap Killers. Good job. Marcos gets that return, and Marcos is going to be the defender for the entire match. Chop Killers is actually in control's base right now, grabs that flag. He's going to have help from Rix, who has his overdrive. Chop Killers is going to drop off the flag to Rix, and Rix is going to get this first flag cap eternity in round four. Great job by eternity. Last match, control got the. Here, Rix is going to be taken out here. My rail gun. Maybe he just wants to get some more cross map shops with the rail gun. Sun pushing in. He's already going to be taken out. Used to drive. I would have saved it. What about the face pushing in? Marcos has his drive, so he's probably going to be able to take out. What about the face? I exclusive pushing in the middle to hopefully contest Rix. He kind of gives up on Ricks there. May, may go for the flag cap. Tor versus Ricks right now. 
Um, Tor has his wasp bomb. All right, Rick's pulling the flag here. Someone walked in my room. In my room, <laughs> guys. Sorry about that. All right, Marco's pushing into the middle here. Semgram pulls the flag now. He's going to help have help from Ricks. They take out what about the f Now Semgram. Third flag capture for eternity in about five minutes. Um, Mar Avetis pulling the flag from eternity right now. Or not eternity, sorry, from control right now. Avetis, well, they're having great map control now. Avetis gets that fourth flag capture pretty easily. I think it's pretty much map control or team controlled now. Marco's pulling the flag from controls base again. Wow, this is just a round wipe here. Marco's pulling this flag, and that's going to be the fifth flag capture for eternity. Who is refreshing voice and commentary box? I don't know. Um, Rick's pulling this flag again. Wow, eternity's doing a great job here. Control really can't have control, just gets taken out. I don't even know if it's team based here. Um, where even is, okay, this is weird. I'm lagging out. Well, uh, everyone's really lagging out here. Kind of the servers are going crap right now. Some grand pulling that flag. I don't know what's going on. There's so much lag. Um, wow. This is looking weird. Okay, I guess nothing really happened. Tor is pushing into Eternity's base, grabbing that flag. Wow, there is so much lag. I can't, I don't even know what's happening. Um, yeah, technical issues here. Um, wow, both teams are just completely lagging out here. Either it's my side. I can't tell if it's just my side, though. Maybe they're not saying this. Um, guys, give us a second. There's some technical things. Um, I am. I don't know what's happening right now. Um, the judges are speaking in Russian. I don't. <laughs> um, I maybe they're gonna have a restart of the round. I'm not sure. Is the match even still going on right now? I'm. I'm so confused. Hmm. Sorry about that, guys. I don't really know what's going on. All right, so it looks like uh, Esmail or the so uh, our uh, if our broadcaster can go ahead and unmute him. Hello, guys, and welcome back again. So uh, looks like Seal was facing few issues. That's why I have to jump in, and thank you, Taspin, for carrying the stream solo for some time so yeah <laughs> actually um uh, i'm joining the map right now i'm not there yet but looks like you guys are saying that there are several lags then yeah it's so, both so, yeah i don't even know it's what, the what's entire happening? the entire red team isn't even here anymore i can't even press tab i can't even see who's in the match anymore um i can probably go ahead and restart my tanky real quick Okay, so I just joined the map and looks like everyone is leaving. 
evening. So, uh, hmm. Looks like it's. it's several lag. Yeah, you're, you're lagging out a bit there. Huh. Oh. Yeah, everyone left that match, so. I don't know if they're going to have a new match. Okay, okay, okay. I don't know what's going to happen here. Um, maybe we'll have some more rounds. I don't know. Depends on if the judges say both teams are able to play for this today. I guess we can go ahead and pull up forum number four. If uh, our broadcaster wants to go ahead and pull that up, it'll be open for around two minutes. And from now, two minutes, guys. Good luck to you answering that in the forum. Or description down below. Because, you know, we don't really know what to do while uh, the judges decide what the future is going to... Okay, uh, so looks like we received we another new link. And looks like this is going to be replayed. Mm -hmm. Oh gosh, we were already so far into that, man. Certainty was doing a great job. I bet they're pretty disappointed. Um, but... Yeah, it was, uh, like, it was kind of halfway, but... Sadly, it looks like we will have to start it all over again. Mm -hmm. That's unfortunate. <laughs> mm -hmm. Indeed. Um, I guess we'll just keep the form up for now. There's nothing really else to show. And I'll be honest, I've run out of material to talk about. So. Yeah, actually, uh, our broadcaster can go on the battle right now and show the players, maybe instead of showing the form so yeah guys uh for some reasons which are really out of our hands looks like this round is going to be replayed and we can't really do anything about it so i i don't really know what happened but it looks like there was a huge server lag because usually small ones wouldn't cause any issues at all but if it's a major one then yeah, uh, kind of in this stuff we have to restart the round and do it like that. We're just restarting round four, right? Mm -hmm. Round number right. four. Uh, just reminding you guys that the form is still open, so make sure that you write your nicknames correctly, so that we can choose three lucky winners after the end of this round and as i always say please make sure that you have logged on forum at least one so that i can send you your promo code mm -hmm. hopefully both teams will restart mm -hmm. get going on and yeah guys it doesn't matter if you are playing on html5 or on flash i mean if it's server lag it will occur anyway it doesn't really matter where you are playing from even if you are playing from your phone. <laughs> but yeah, you guys have to adapt and start playing in HTML5 from now if you haven't done that because uh, how many months are left? Like three more months? I think it's two to three more months until okay uh, around around two to three more months and flash client will be removed from the game and the only way to play tanky is from the HTML5 client only so either way you guys will have to adapt from that so my advice to you is start playing and using HTML5 from now mm -hmm. like uh, Nox there's a new type of uh, flash thing coming out that um, Tanky might utilize. So you never know, guys. There's always more options. Mm -hmm. Both teams still have yet to, to reset. Not really much to talk about here. Not really. Um... So yeah, looks like this stream is going to to, uh, to take yeah, you're lagging more bad. time. Am I, am I lagging? Yeah. Uh, okay. <laughs> I don't even know what just happened. Like you said. Can teams please reset now? 
Um, yeah, guys. There's, uh, I don't know what to say now because, you know, I kind of used my only talking points earlier when five minute timeout or when there's a five minute um, delay. Um, guys, if you want to ask some questions in the comments, that'll help me out so I can uh, stray off on a different conversation. Okay, so uh, to be honest, uh, at this moment, I have no idea what are we waiting for exactly. I don't. I have no clue. Um. Yeah. Same thing here. But they are chatting. So okay. Wait. Wait. Let me see. The esports admin just said something. So let me let me check it. Uh, okay, nothing really new, just saying the score and the round is going to be replayed, which we already know, but, uh, uh, okay, finally, it looks like the players are resetting right now, and hopefully after two to three minutes, we are going to start round number four. This has to be the longest round in Tanky Online history. Okay, so Tanky Gamer asks, I I run. There's actually a video on this on the uh, Tanky. If you look up in the forum, um, Tanky FPS, there's a lot of ways. Or in the forum, there's a lot of ways that you can actually improve your FPS on HTML5. I advise you go to the forum and uh, look up keywords like FPS, um, increase FPS, and there's actually a lot of ways that there's uh, you can improve it. All right, so hopefully um, the rest of the guys leave. This has been a long uh, round for... Yeah, yes, indeed. In the meantime, we can ask our broadcast to, to choose the winners. Okay, our broadcaster is eating, and he can't really communicate with us, but at least he can listen, so yeah. He's the one who can eat right now because he's not talking, so, yeah. <laughs> but, well, but, you know, sh sharing is caring after all. I, I, I wish to be in his position right now. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, wait. wait that, that's your main position after all. I mean, you oh, yeah. are supposed to be a broadcaster, not it's, a commentator. It's kind of hard when uploads be bad. Uh, I know, right? Okay, so the three winners are Ole. Nick Bang, Riyadh, the, the Dark, congratulations guys, you will be receiving your promo codes as soon as possible, probably in a few days in forum. Alright, both teams have solved, but the timer is staying at so I don't know the time. Um, is it doing that for you guys, or is it just me? I may have to restart. All right, looks like our bot. It also happened to our broadcast. Because the time is showing 12 constant. It's oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Same, 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 oh, same, same, yeah, yeah, same thing for me. I'll go ahead and restart, see if that helps. Oh, both teams are resetting again when I left. Maybe it was doing it for everyone. I'm not sure. Um, maybe. The map itself. Uh, uh, me? All right. Hopefully, both teams. Will... Casper. Okay. Who are you talking to? Both of us. Oh gosh, the time is still twelve minutes. I think they're gonna have to make a new map. What? Yeah, I think they're gonna have to make a new map because the time is stuck at twelve twelve minutes. I, I'm not sure. Maybe it's hopefully it's just for me, and it's not for every other person.
Um, the time is still the same for our broadcast. No, no, here. the time is decreasing right now. All right. Hopefully, it's just our side. I'll try and keep you guys updated on the. Actually, I can't keep you updated on the time because it still says twelve minutes. For... Maybe, maybe, maybe Asmel can keep you guys updated on how much longer is in the map. Because uh, um, one more minute. It's 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 eleven eleven minutes. For... All right, eleven minutes. So one minute till they actually self-destruct, and finally round four will begin after like twenty-five minutes. All right, the broadcaster is going to refresh one more time, so hopefully it gets fixed. Um, my tab isn't even working. That's unfortunate. My, I'm gonna restart my game as well. Oh, my tap is working right now. So I'm, I'm getting unlucky. So yeah, finally we have 20 seconds before we start round number four. If things were going in the normal way, then it would have been probably round number six. Oh gosh, don't make me think of what could have been. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Not trying to. Anyway, the players have finally self-destructed, and round number four finally is starting. Yeah, finally. All right. So Eternity is going to be on bleed, and Control is on red side. Sip. So, round four started. Some grand. Oh, um, some grand just stopped for no reason. I don't know if that was lag. Um, did Sun just stop for no reason, or is that lag? Uh, I don't okay, know. Yeah. That's it's just some lag okay. going on. All right, Vettis is moving back to his base to defend until he gets supplies again. Exclusive is pushing in with his hunter overdrive. Should be able to take out a Vettis pretty easily there. So Exclusive is currently taking the flag. He was being blocked by his teammate. He still have his overdrive ready. Oh wait, did they stop? Oh, oh gosh. Uh, oh. I believe. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Uh, control before uh, before the server lag like, happened had one zero. Who had like one flag captured or? Um, before the server lag like, started. Before happening, the server lag, like, what was the score? It was uh, one one for the overall rounds, and Eternity was winning five. No, no, I mean just in the round. Score in in the round. No. Oh. Eternity was winning in the very first round we played when server lag started happening. I'm I'm confused as to what the judges are gonna say here, because the servers are just you know, they're not doing well right now. At least not for non pro battles. Okay, so uh, sorry guys for that. Just stay with us till we discover what's happening right now. Because to be honest, I have no idea. Okay, are they gonna make a new map or something? I'm so confused. I, uh, I, 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 I don't know. Uh, this is the I first mean, time for me that server lag has stopped a match twice. Maybe there's just a lot of people. Oh. A new map. <sighs> so it's a new map. <clears throat> Amazing. I'm hoping this map doesn't lag out as well. I joined this map that was just like. All right, hopefully we got a new one. All right, cool. Yes, we did. The member limit's a bit bigger, but I don't think that'll really affect anything. Huh? All right, hopefully both teams will reset pretty quickly. Oh, okay. I'm going to... Hopefully...
Okay, so I'm in the new map right now. Yes, same. Okay, so uh, <laughs> no, I don't think this stream is going to be the longest ever for the records. Like we we used to have longer ones before for grand finals and stuff. My longest like, stream was four hours. Ah, uh, yeah, I remember this one. Six months ago. Mm-hmm. Or four months. It was uh, between who? Eternity and or or wait, it was penguins and someone else. I forgot to. Anyway, so uh, so yeah, this one is not going to. It's not going to be the longest. And sorry again, but we'll just have to wait. So. Here with us guys hopefully this is going to be starting soon and we can start and resume our match again hopefully okay so our broadcaster has just joined the map so at least he will show you what's happening instead of looking at that static thumbnail which is not doing anything and yeah, it doesn't even have my name. But okay. Um, the next form should be after this round. So, uh, yeah. Really. Oh. Okay, so have they reset? No, they haven't. They didn't reset it. But hopefully they will soon. Yeah, hopefully. Um, so this is still round four. Gosh, six rounds after. <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> oh, gosh. That's all right. It's all right. Maybe Eternity or um, Control will just wipe the, wipe the floor and easily win the next three well, rounds. Well, the, the thing is, it's currently a tie. It's one to one. Oh, gosh. So... It's not like any one of them have, you know, an advantage over the other one. It, it's tie, so... It's okay, yeah. it's okay. Come on, Trinity. <laughs> you've, you've won so many before, Trinity. Yeah, Before indeed. this one. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. This one is not a big deal at all. I mean, I'm sure for well, you, get a lot of I'm, I'm, I'm just a little bit sad because these issues are happening uh, it makes everyone bored it makes me bored myself and obviously the rest mm -hmm. of you guys so it's not really the best atmosphere in doing a stream but, but yeah stuff like that happens once in a while it, it's a oh. good thing it doesn't really happen all the time so it's okay when it happens we will have to deal with it and that's it so uh Looks like uh, the match was restarted by one of, uh, actually by the admin, which is inside the battle right now. So hopefully, uh, after two minutes, we start round number four. And this time we have no issues. Because Eternity was winning. They were winning, they were yeah, they, were, they, they were, weren't they the were lead, going. but yeah, yeah. They had five flags in five minutes. They were doing incredibly well. And oh, boom. look. Look at the chat. These people want cookies. Cookies? Mm-hmm. A cyborg. It's a massive cookie. Okay, wait. Casper, uh, what are you eating? Like, look at those people, man. They want cookies. Maybe you could give them some? Oh, okay. Casper uh, uh, is eating pizza, which is even more better. 
So hey guys, maybe you can mention him and ask him for a slice or something. Yeah. What's what's your uh, favorite? Oh, they already did. It. What's your guys' favorite pizza in the chat? Mine is a uh, chicken and white sauce. I would say anything which doesn't have pineapple on it. Yeah, who put pineapple on pizza? I mean, seriously. Uh. Wow. It, it, it was a trend. You didn't know. If I want pineapple, I'll cut up a pineapple, eat it for fruit. Exactly. That's well, I would say then pepperoni, maybe pasta. Yeah, pepperoni is pretty good. Depends on where you get it from. Like uh, Domino's doesn't have that good of pepperoni, so, in my opinion. Yeah. What is this, tanky or pizza stream? Ah, <laughs> uh, you know, I would, I would go for Caesar for Little Caesar. Little Caesars has some pretty good pizza. Mm -hmm, indeed. <laughs> like what pizza <laughs> doing at Easter points? <laughs> We've been on round four for like thirty minutes now. What did you expect? All right, please, thirty seconds until hopefully no more technical difficulties, and we just get going. You know, quick. Okay, a question related to Tanky. What turret is best to be used with Hopper? Uh, maybe Taylor can say that. From my opinion, I would say Ricochet. I'd say Railgun just because I played with Railgun in the special event, and it seemed, you know, pretty good. Of course, you're one-shotting everyone, but it still seemed pretty, mm -hmm. like, one of the best turrets. Because when you're hopping around, you, you're going to be able to see people across the map. So you're gonna to want to have to have a turret that can see across, that can shoot across the map. So having long range yeah. turrets with it, even though I don't, yeah. I don't think it is gonna load up nearly as fast as it did in the special. Uh, event. Taylor, do you see what's happening? What's happening? Oh, the round started. Okay, sorry about that. What All started? Right. Eternity are not in the map. Oh, what? No. Oh, I was like, let's go. Round started. Oh, no. I guess it okay. didn't. Okay. Uh, I don't know. Maybe Eternity players are feeling hungry. That's why they want to eat instead. And they don't really care about the match right now. Yeah, they can push it. I don't know. Okay. Let me see what's being said. Oh, Vulcan with heat immunity is pretty good for Hop. OP Danny. Nice. Uh... Yeah. Well, I have ho uh, Hopper M0. Would that count? I have Hopper MK1 because I don't have crystals. I spent them all on uh, protections. Wait, you don't have crystals since when? No, well, I have. I have like six hundred thousand, but <laughs> I'm waiting. I'm waiting till sales. Okay, that's what I meant. You know, I'm, not, I'm not about. I'm not about to spend six hundred thousand to get it to MK7. <laughs> that's what I meant. Because I spent like three million on sales on protections. Uh, getting okay. It. I've been saving up for a long time. I don't know if it's just the servers that just, you know, aren't playable right now, or why they just left. Maybe they're resetting one more time, I'm not sure. Uh, I don't know. Uh, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm just, I'm just waiting, I'm waiting for confirmation from Dan's commander. To know what's happening right now, like if we are going to continue, or, or the match will be postponed to another time, or I don't yeah, really maybe know. We'll, maybe we'll push everything a day forward until the servers are more stable. Because we've been on round four for the past thirty-five, forty minutes, and it just it definitely can get a bit boring for you guys and for us when there's nothing happening. <laughs> uh, uh, right now again I, I have the Okay. 
so yeah, at, at least guys, it, it was fun before all these issues happened. The match was going in a good way. At least we are here talking with each other, having fun. We laughed for a bit, talking about pizza, cookies, and stuff like that. So yeah, it wasn't bad after all. Hmm, I guess, yeah. Okay. And I see that the broadcaster is showing an empty an empty map right now with maybe one or two persons inside of it. Do we have another map? Uh, no, 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 no. Wait, let me see. Do we have another map? Oh, we do have another map. Amazing. So we just received another link. Let me see. That's an incredible map. Even me as an admin, I'm shocked. Here you go, time to wait until round four starts again. Okay, listen, uh, let me tell you something. Uh, okay, guys. Get inside the map, let's see if they are starting right now, or they will be resetting. My man, right again. now. Looks like they're gonna reset. Looks like they're resetting. They're gonna, they're gonna reset. I swear if they lag out again, I'm just, I'm, I don't know. Okay, guys, 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 we'll be opening the form right now. You guys have two minutes. To write your nicknames, please write them right now and make sure that they are correct. Also, we'll be having uh, a pause from our side. We will be not, we will not be talking till the round starts. So wait for us.
Okay, guys, so we are back after the pause, which we took. Round number four has finally started. Players are currently attacking with their overdrives. Hopefully, they are making damage because the issue was that the issue was that uh, when they are shooting, they were not making any damage at all. That's why we had to stop for a few times, and the map was created several times. So, from what I'm seeing, looks like players are dealing damage to each other. So. Hopefully yeah, this round is going to continue in a good way. That was almost an hour. That was like 40 minutes. We were stuck on that for a little while. Hopefully it's fixed now and we can just rounds without any technical difficulties. Get through this pretty quick. So now there's six full rounds after this. We still got to finish round four. And based on both teams' performances, we're probably going to have all six rounds and that's gonna be mm -hmm. long um sam yeah so there. sam grant just flipped himself over there looks like sun is going to return the flag no one from eternity was close enough to take the flag or anything so it was a turn what about the face is escaping but very nice shot by the magnum by abatis i don't know from where did he shot but it was very nice dew is having full drags and full hp as well and that looks like is going to be an easy capture for him mm -hmm. good job by um control getting that first flag capture i still feel bad for eternity because they were winning round four when it first started lagging and if they lose this round it's just going to be a big kick in the butt um do defending here with sun rick's pushing in some grand gets flipped sun is low hp rick's needs to take him out pretty quickly here mm -hmm. okay so rex is just taking a step back he is trying to avoid damage by sun and very nice ricochet effect there by him oh actually he's he still managed to survive but with almost zero hp can he can he jump down avatis is coming for the help he takes the flag but wait oh alpha afla was uh was taken out by the shaft yeah, yeah. Gosh, That's why now, he there's, was lagging. now there's the shaft glitch for him. Mm -hmm. And yeah, a very good. nice capture by Abatis. I mean, if it wasn't for uh, for Rex for making that jump and escaping with zero HP, he wouldn't have made that capture. Sam Grant as well still having the flag, but almost zero HP. He managed to jump down. Maybe Rex can take it. Rex hits the wall and then exclusive drive. They forgot to turn off supplies. I oh, know they forgot to turn off uh, gold boxes here. So yeah, Af Afla, <laughs> I, I, I guess uh, Afla uh, dropped a gold box by mistake. I usually do that when I'm when I'm uh, what's called hitting number five to put in mine. I drop a gold box by mistake as well. So yeah, Sam Grant is again taking the flag. This time no one is near him at all. Everything is looking perfectly fine for him. Marcus is next time for sport. And wow, what a very easy solo capture. Good job by Semgrand. And there we go. Just like that, Eternity is taking the lead. Just like they did in the original round. Um, hopefully they can get the round win. So they technically didn't lose much for having to reset. Semgrand pushing in to Control's base here. He does get taken out. Um, he's self-destructed, I guess. A lot of players self-destructed on both sides. Mm -hmm. um, Avet is pushing in to control his base as well. Dew and Sun are there to defend. Sun uses his Hornet Overdrive. He's able to take out um, Avet. Oh, very nice shot by Sun. He managed to take Rex with one shot. And Dew gave him again full supplies and as well as a charge for the Overdrive. I don't know what he's waiting for. Okay, he's going for the flag right now. Uh, well, Eternity, almost all of them just got full supplies there. And, and on the other side of the map, uh, well, oh, okay, okay. He's waiting, trying to avoid Avatis because he's again with Overdrive as well, so he can take him out with one shot, so that's why. Sun lagged out there, or I guess he has. But now, what about the face? Is he across? Avetis and Semgran both going in to take him out. What about the face now? Has zero supplies. He gets taken out here. Sun. 
Oh, gets a great double kill on both some grand and Ricks, and he's going to get the second flag capture for control. Mm -hmm. Indeed, very nice. It, it looks like he had three overdrives in one minute or something. Very nice. So again, it's a tie. We still have like five minutes left. Drop killers was there, but you makes a shot. He snipes him from down with his railgun, so the flag stays above. Mm -hmm. Abatis is attacking again with overdrive, but what about the face is next to him trying to make him miss with his armor, but he can't. And right now it's going to be 1v1, but Sun managed out to knock Abatis because both of them are using the most dangerous combo in this format, which is Hornet and Magnum and obviously overdrive. Yep, Do used his um, overdrive there, and now Sun is going to have Hornet overdrive again. This is what like he's he's getting it almost every single minute. He's doing a good job of getting kills when he has it on, and now he's just staying in the back until he can see the perfect time to push. What about the face? Is now super low here. Sun's pushing in with the momentum that what about the face made? Ooh, I guess he will be waiting. Quick. He will be waiting before he uses overdrive right now. Oh, uh, yeah, troop killers. Uh, probably is not going to use his overdrive right now as well. He will wait for the right moment, but yeah, he's still going. What about the face? Just changed to Sander right now. He's not using hammer anymore. Let's see if this actually makes a difference. Rick's pushing in right now with Viking overdrive. He uses repair now, and maybe he, he's going to need to take out. Oh, Sun gets oh, the shot. Oh, no. Sun was already waiting for him. Even so, Rix was full HP, but he was killed instantly with one shot. Yeah, that, that Hornet would annoy me if I kept getting one shot back and forth. Is uh, pushing yeah. in <laughs> yeah. right now. He has help from Chop Killers. Um, what about the face? Kind oh, of look, look, man. Abatis was just, like, pushing so that he could take the flag. Oh, Rix is still there, full HP. Is anyone shooting him? Oh no, there isn't. Looks like this is going to be uh, another capture, which makes the scores three to two. He will he's dropping it to Maricus because he's dictator, so he should capture the flag to get an overdrive charge so that he can give it to everyone else. Mm hmm Three two lead for eternity right now. We need to hopefully keep this up. Um the Marcos takes out Tor, who is pushing in. Sun's now pushing in, he has that horn drive. Um, he doesn't really have any help from any of his teammates, though, so I doubt he'll use it yet. What about the face is pushing him with his Viking overdrive? Yeah, um, but he's not going to use it right now. Otherwise, he will kill himself. He's currently shooting Rex. Okay, going for the flag. Maybe he drops on the mine. Oh, no, he didn't. He surprised he didn't use his him. overdrive on Rex there. He could have taken out Rex and then easily gotten that flag. No. Hey, he's using a sender, which means splash damage, so he would have killed himself as well. Alright, Dew pulling... Okay, I guess Dew doesn't want to go for that flag. I think he realizes he's the dictator. Dictators don't really go for the flags much. No, no, I was like, okay, I will try to make much damage to Apatis as much as possible because he's using his overdrive. Mm -hmm. And yeah, actually, he managed to do that. But still, uh, we have one minute, 30 seconds left. Currently, Eternity are on the lead, so my predictions are it's it's either going to stay like that, or maybe Control will be capturing one more flag, and this round will be ending up in a tie. Mm -hmm. Right now, it's a one-one tie for both teams, so this round is super able to you know obtain the lead. So Do pushing in with Sun, both of them are pretty low now. Do just used his only repair. Um, oh wow, he uses his Dictator Overdrive though. And now Sun is going to have his Hornet Overdrive. Mm -hmm. Rex just used his Overdrive as well. Can he manage to take Sun? He didn't. Oh, but very nice Sun, very nice job by Trap Killers. He managed to kill him even though he was on Overdrive. Right now, what about the face taking the flag? It's the last 40 seconds. They either capture this flag oh. or lose this round. Afla I'm has dropped his Wasp Bomb, but he didn't take anyone. Sun and you are coming for the rescue. Is there is enough time to capture the flag? He drops it to Sun, which oh, nothing yeah, is no blocking there. his way, and looks like Control will be taking the tie in this round as well. Very so nice. For themselves right now. There we go. Still <laughs> one one tie now after this round. We mm -hmm. still have six rounds to go. 
But since it's a tie, that means if one team wins the next three out of six rounds, or next four out of six rounds, they'll be winning. But based on the oh wait play, wait think. wait wait one second, uh, I forgot to say that. But uh, the the referee said before this round start that one of them have a uh, one flag lead. I don't really know who. I believe it's Eternity. So that. This Either round one? didn't end up in a tie. It's four to three, and yeah, the judge said four three for eternity. Yeah, so that means they yeah. won the round. So that they means won it's the be round. a two one lead now. Mm-hmm. I think I think it's because of eternity. I think because they had a lead. Game. They had a lead. Yeah, before silver lag happened and all of that. So yeah, it's actually really fair. They ended up getting the round win at the end of the day. So I get. I'm sure they're happy about that. Also, right, we cool. can ask in the chat to make sure. Yeah. Map two is over. We have three more maps to go. Nope, four more maps. Nope, three, sorry. <laughs> There's 10 rounds, not, not 12. Mm-hmm. Like the total score, uh, I mean, total rounds for this match is 10 rounds. Um, right now, our broadcaster will be picking up three lucky winners on the screen. So... Please show them. All right, so the winners are X R I S T O S fifteen. The beginning part. That was weird. Oh yeah. Okay. It's okay. Uh, Christus fifteen. The killer. Jodei Beltas and Garage the Crazy. Congratulations, guys. Yep, congrats to you guys. Sorry about that, my mic just randomly stopped working for a second there. It's okay. Too many weird things have been happening for today. Okay, so right now, we are going to see another map. It's not Tupaka anymore. This time we are going to play on Puprusk. And uh, actually, that's one of the very good maps for uh, this tournament of Dream Team. Uh, it's not really that much of a balance set, but at least it's a good one. Like We should see some intense performance in this round. Mm-hmm. Red Team has a bit higher height. But blue team also has a, a direct yeah, way. Yeah, higher ground. Blue team has that little center bridge, though. So both te- both sides have their advantages here. So it'll be interesting to see how either team is going to utilize their advantage. So this is round five out of ten. Still five rounds, to, or six rounds to go. Oh, jeez. Six rounds, so... Right now, Eternity has a 2-1 lead, which means out of the six rounds, if they win the next three, um, that'll be the end of it. But if they don't, we'll be uh, here for another hour and a half. Hopefully not. (laughs) Hopefully Eternity can, you know, do really good here so that they can, we can just get through these rounds fast. We've been live for about an hour, 45 minutes here, guys, so hopefully it doesn't last too much longer. I know everyone has stuff to do, but to be honest, you guys are invested in this match, so it's always fun for us to bring it to you. All right, so both teams are resetting now, which means about two minutes until round five begins. How many forms did we do till now? We've done How five many waves. waves? Five waves? Okay. All right, so. We will wait before we do another one. All right. <laughs> Whatever that noise was that our broadcaster just made. All right, cool. One minute, 15 seconds until five starts. Both teams, of course. Doing the typical Acida trick for them to get their overdrives. And then 
be interesting to see how the dictators defend here. So uh, each, each team right now is doing the trick by charging overdrive for dictator that, so that he can give it to everyone else. And mainly the Viking is the one who needs it the most. Actually, that this one is new. We are looking at two dictators, Isida, charging overdrive. Like we usually see only one, not two. So, mm -hmm. That's new. Sun and Av Avidas are going to be, or uh, Avidas, Avid Avitus. Oh my gosh, his name is kind of annoying. But yeah, they're both going to be crucial for this round because, of course, they're the Hornet, and the Hornet can one shot basically anyone. Mm -hmm. Indeed. So, what changes do we see? Uh, actually, round number five is starting right now. And on both sides. Rex is using now Hammer and Viking instead of Ricochet, unlike the previous time. Uh, what Where else? Like... Face is using Railgun instead of Thunder. Mm -hmm. The Sun Sun is using oh still using Magnum as well. So yeah, mm -hmm. whatever. Uh, we do see some changes. Troop killers. Oh, gets knocked out very quickly by Sun over there. Can he take Maricus as well? Amazing. And oh, you wow. just gave him full supplies and probably more than fifty percent. Oh wow, wait, yes, he have no, I have his overtime again. Wow. That's incredible! Oh, wow. oh wait, look at Rex Viking. comes out of nowhere and kills him with his overdrive. Oh my god, man. So after what Sun has made, he didn't end up in a oh, capture, no. but again he takes Rick and... Man, what's happening? All I see is just Hornets and Magnums killing everyone with one shot. Mm-hmm. Vettis is gonna take out Sun pretty quickly now. <laughs> He's like, okay, I should take you right now so that I can capture this flag. Actually, Avatis have a great chance right now. Oh, yeah. Indeed, that should be an easy capture. There we go. First cap for Eternity. Looks okay. like Afla is dropping a gold box again. This time it's dropping on center. And he manages to flip next to the gold box. Oh, look at it. It's dropping right now. No one is going for it. Definitely. Mm -hmm. Sun with another attack, but he doesn't have his double armor. He needs to move quickly before troop killers comes to him. He didn't kill him out, and he returns the flag. What about the face? Oh, the flag is with, is exclusive right now, but his nitro has just run out. Does he have his repair kit? Oh, looks like not. But what about the face has taken it again? But I don't think he's going anywhere. He's being frozen right now, and he can't oh, really escape. That freeze out for freeze alteration for trap kill. Even if he gets just a little bit, oh wow, okay, he misses. Oh, troop kill just used his overdrive for nothing. It didn't really catch Sun, and Sun is still alive. He's still there. He will. Oh wait, but his overdrive ran out, and he... oh my gosh, great shot from Who Rex shot him? there. Oh man, okay, Rex is the anti Sun. Okay, I mean oh, anti for him. <laughs> But still, they will capture that flag anyway. Mm -hmm. And again, it's a tie, one to one, and we have seven minutes left on the clock. No, great job by both teams. That Hornet is just the MVP for both sides. They have to do the most damage, and they have been both Avetis and Sun have basically been the MVPs for their own teams. Both have been the only. One's basically pulling the flag. Cap, wow, Tor Alpha is pulling the flag right now with his Wasp. He gets that Wasp bomb off on Marikos. He's going to be able to get the second capture for their team for control. Indeed, very nice. Looks like control are controlling the map right now. And if they are lucky enough, they can capture the third flag. But Rex again with his overdrive. Of Marcos Rex uses is the MVP player. for the class. Mm -hmm. Marikos just uses overdrive to charge Rex. And okay, where is Sun? Where is Avatis? I'm trying to to see where are they. Yes, I haven't seen Avatis spawn in a bit. Where is Maybe he? Yeah, out. yeah. Av looks like yeah. Looks like Avatis lagged out because Oscar has joined as a substitute for him. So. 
Oh no. They almost were able to pull that flag, but now dude's gonna get the return. He's waiting for the return, I guess. Mm -hmm. There we go. Trap killer's pulling the flag now. Oh, he does he decides not to use his overdrive. Smart play. He didn't have double armor, so he knew he couldn't make it out. Yeah. Also Oscar joined with Hornet and Railgun. He didn't join with Magnum, so I don't know if this is going to be to be an issue for some. Maybe on this map it works a bit better, especially if you have large caliber rounds. But the one shot ability for Magnum is just it's it's, it's insane. Crazy. Yeah, it's insane. Look at Sun again. With a capture, definitely going to be a capture. Oh wait, maybe Oscar can take him. Ooh, he takes him with one I, oh, oh, oh my god. god, he fell into ditch while trying to return. That's so unfortunate. Oh. Uh, meanwhile, ex exclusive used his hunter, and now he's probably get this capture. Rix is pulling the flag right now. I didn't even notice that both. Teams. And looks like oh, how'd that wasp bomb just get Rix? How? That thing was so far uh, away. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Sometimes it does magic. So, so currently we are seeing a standoff. Each dictator each side is holding the flag, but Sam Grant takes it and Afla is coming behind Sam Grant. What's happening? Chop kills. Oh, it was. Yep, Chop kills. Wait, wait, return. wait. Afla can return the flag, maybe? Oh my god. Oh my god. Return. Very nice. Okay. So each side returns the flag. And the score remains 2-1 to one to control. Man, this is intense. I love Both it. Both teams are doing a great job. I'd say it's almost 50-50 here. Just Eternity got unlucky there with both those flags being captured pretty quickly. Um, Sun waiting for his Hornet overdrive because he's MVP with that. Marcos used his Dictator overdrive for both Rick's and Oscar. Oscar has that railgun. Okay, misses the shot. Okay, time for Oscar to push in with his overdrive. He has normal, looks like, round stabilization. Yeah, round stabilization, yeah. Like the one which is being used in uh, the MOOTS tournaments. But look at Rex. Can he escape? Can he escape with zero HP? Oh, epic. Epic. And he makes a capture. He drops it to Oscar, and Oscar takes the capture. I thought that you would take him out with his freeze, but looks like the range wasn't close enough. That's why he managed to escape, and again, the score is a tie. Mm -mm. Yes, 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 I know. What's this one? Thing is, all of them look the same. Uh, all of the attrition look the same. Sometimes I get confused with the names. Yep, Even Sam right Grand... now, I, I I see that double armor dropping without the parachute. So. Sam Grand did a good job picking up that um, repair. He gets the wasp on off. He's gonna take out Dew. This is the perfect time for Eternity to push in. Oh wait, never mind. There's three people from uh, Control defending right now. Rix is gonna get obliterated. No, he doesn't get obliterated. He's pulling the flag now. Uh, Do spawns in right behind him and is able to keep him from leaving the base. Mm -hmm. So hopefully, all I wish is that this this round is not going to be ended up in a tie. I would yeah, like someone to win. The Ooh, face is that was attacking with his overdrives, but troop killers goes back to him and. Taylor, I'm having a phone call, so be right back. All right, cool. So Rix is pushing in right now to control space. He has his overdrive, but we're in overdrive here. He's going to be hopefully able to take out. Uh, okay, he still is really good now. Uh, Marcus misses that overdrive, but now he has it. Okay, exclusive uses the overdrive. Both teams are just pushing in here. Rix used his Viking overdrive. He needs to use it to his advantage. Oh, no, he's going to get taken out, and the flag's going to get returned. Meanwhile, Tor is pulling their flag right now. He has that wasp, which means he has speed. But, okay, there's a bit of technical. No, never mind, we're good. Exclusive is pulling the flag right now with double drops. He still has that repair as well. This looks like he's just going to race home and get this flag capture. And he will, making it 3-2 lead for... Um, for control right now. 
All right, this makes it a bit more difficult for Eternity. Eternity needs to grab this flag quickly. There's exactly one minute left. Um, both teams don't really have either, any overdrives. So Oscar's going to do barely any damage here on Do. It's going to be three shots. Okay, well, Oscar's shot basically did no damage there. That was a bit unfortunate. 45 seconds here. Um, Chop Killers uses his overdrive. He has help. And from Rix, maybe this can be a pull. Rix is pulling the flag right now. Almost everyone was destroyed, so that means Sun has Sun gets taken out as well. As long okay, what am I, never mind. What the great face has his overdrive and he takes out all of them. And there we go. Wasp bomb gonna do nothing there. And that was an unfortunate push. And now control is gonna have 4-2 lead for round number five, making it a tied up 2-2. Um, which means we're gonna have even more rounds after this. So there we go. The round is finished. Tied up 2-2 for both Eternity and Control. There we go, round five finished. And uh, it's tied up now. Go, anyone's game. Hopefully it's one person's game for the next five rounds. So we don't have to do all five rounds. We can just do. Oh, gosh, please, please, please. OK, so round six going to be starting here in a second. Both teams have dropped in two minutes until self-destruct start. Sun has just been doing so much damage here with his overdrive. They're going to need to find a way to be able to take him out very quickly because based on last round, Sun is just the absolute MVP. Are both teams resetting again? Oh, yeah, I can switch the overlay now. Give me a second. I think I'm on the right website. I haven't mean, I had to switch the overlay in a long time. Oh, well, I think I got it. All right, here we go. Um, round six, switch sides. There we go. Overlay switch. So attorney's gonna be on red. Control's gonna be on blue. Um, a minute and a half until hopefully round six starts, and there's no more technical difficulties again. That would be unfortunate, and would probably end the stream if there's more technical difficulties because that's just, you know, that's tough. <laughs> All right. Yep. It looks like both teams are now healing each other to get their. So it just looks like a good round six. Um, guys, we'll go ahead and open one more form after next round, except we've already reached six is our max, and we've already gotten to five because, you know, what else were we supposed to do when the entire game was just slow or when we were experiencing technical difficulties? So after next round, we'll go ahead and open up one more. There's... All right, so 45 seconds until the round's going to begin. Um, both teams are playing really well, except hopefully um, Eternity is going to be able to get this round win, especially when they're on the better side, in my opinion, because there's more cover. Oh, but yeah, 30 seconds until the round's going to start. And yeah, it should be interesting. Let's see if there's any roster changes. Can't really tell until someone leaves. I think um, Avetis is back in instead of uh, the other person. I forgot who his name was. But yeah, yeah, Oscar, because Avetis lagged out and Oscar had to take Avetis's place. But it looks like both teams have self destructed and now Avetis is back in his place. Um, is Avetis going to use Railgun? No, he's going to go back to Magnum. Um, did barely any damage to so what about the face? Yeah, basically almost every single person from each team has Magnum protection. That's how strong Magnum is in these games. Mavetis has his overdrive down now with the Hornet. Um, hopefully they can do something here. Sun also has his overdrive down. Okay, oh, Rix is damage with his. He's going to take out... Okay, well, Wasp Bomb's going to take out... Okay, doesn't take out Risk. He, or Rix. Yep. Pull for Eternity right now. Um, okay, never mind. Sun's going to get that double kill. Oh. Sun is just 
with overdrive, it's just almost impossible to beat him. Even without overdrive, Magnum is still doing a ton of damage if they don't have double armor. But yep, there we go. First capture for eternity less than what we like to see. Marcos used his overdrive now. He's just starting to or their base so that no one can push in. Marcos is just doing a great job of defending this round. It's a bit easier to defend red base as well because there's limited entries. As if you're on blue side, there's literally one, two, three, four, five as compared to three entrances on red side. Um, Rix is going to wait to return it because Tor is sitting there on the flag. Good job by Rix. He knows what he's doing. Rix gets the return now. Tor is now pushing. Grabs the flag. Mark. Here. No, oh, Marcos is actually destroyed so all his mines went away. Uh, his freeze, freeze alteration just isn't coming. Oh, good job of Marcos there. Gets the return. Chop kills is actually pulling Control's flag right now. He's able to get the return. Or Control's able to get that return there. Uh, Vetus is grabbing Control's flag, but Dude does a great job of defending. and gets the return. Semgrand pushing in with his Wasp Firebird. Gets that Wasp Bomb off if he can go off in time. Uh, it's going to get zero people. Exclusive does a great job at just denying that. Marcos gets the return on his own flag. And Chop Kill is trying to grab that flag. He's going to probably get... Okay, no, he has help from both Rix and Avetis. They can maybe pull this off. Rix is now pulling the flag. Doesn't have double armor. Doesn't really matter, though. He's just making his way across the right side. He's in the ditch. He has help from Avetis. He's going to get taken out, but Tor is the only one there left to defend. Oh, Tor gets flipped now. Avetis is zero health. Oh, no, he's going to be right into exclusive. Marcos gets a great spawn, uses his Dictator Overdrive. Exclusives is going to get taken out. Dew is right behind, but he's he's getting affected by that freeze. And there we go. Second capture for Eternity. And now that makes it a 2-0 lead for Eternity. Great job by them. That was an awesome pull. They were able to take out everyone left and right. Marcos had a great overdrive as well. Avetis in the middle. He also has his overdrive. Sun does as well, but he has a bit more high ground. If he gets the call out, he can do some great damage here. Oh, yep, there he goes. One shots of Vettis. Rix is waiting because he knows Sun will shot him. Either way, Rix gets taken out and the flag gets returned. What about the face lagged out there? He went, he had to leave and join. Um, Tor tried to push in there. So drive. He's and it looks like Sun, Sun is going to get taken out. Marco still defending. All right. Marcos, great job there. Um, Actually, Rix is pulling the flag right now. And he has help from all his team, and he's probably going to get this flag cap. There we go. 3-0 lead for Eternity. Which, it's tied right now 2-2, so this is a big, big round for them. Even though it's been back and forth, back and forth usually. As long as Eternity can keep up this lead, they'll probably be able to get the round victory and get the 3-2 lead, which means they'll need to win the next... If they win this one, they'll only need to win two in a row after that to, in order to win for the day. Hopefully they do, or else we're going to be here for another hour and a half. <laughs> and it's, it's a long time, guys. I'm not going to lie. Especially in the middle of a school week where, you know, you have stuff to do. Exclusive takes out some grand on blue flag. Right now, Tor is pushing on the left side of the base. He has help from what about the face? What about the face has his overdrive? Um, I'd use it now. He does. Just using that wall to his advantage. He's going to be able to take out almost everyone from Eternity's base. I exclusive pulling the flag now. A little bit of lag there. Oh, Vet, he's lagging on a vet is bad. Doesn't really matter. Exclusive pulling the flag now. He's down in the middle. Um, wastes his overdrive. Don't really know what that was for, but it was kind of wasteful, and some grand's going to get the read. So good job. Um, some grand pulling this flag right now. Eternity's just doing a great job on red side. I think, yeah, I think this, this map's a little bit side based. Um, 
Some grand has that repair for him. He's going to grab it there. And that looks like it's going to be the fourth capture for eternity in just over half the round. Sam Grand used his Wasp Bomb before he died, and he's, he's going to be able to take out Exclusive. Good job by him. Marcos has his Dictator Overdrive. He may use it here. Um, he's waiting for Avetis to come in. Oh, wow. That's a very effective Dictator Overdrive. Avetis now has his um, Hunt Hornet Overdrive. He's going to push with Sam Grand. Wait, I guess he's kind of just staying back for now. Okay, now he's pushing in. Maybe he can take out Dew? No, Sun's going to take out Avetis before his shot will do damage. Um, Rick's pushing in. Dew is the only one there to defend. Uh, doesn't look like Rick's can do much. He doesn't have a repair, and Dew's going to take him out. Exclusive and Tor both are in Eternity's base right now. They need to get out of there. The Wasp Bomb was able to take out two of them, which means they're not going to be spawned. Oh, now they're going to spawn in. Marcos is going to do some shots to Exclusive. Ooh, exclusive got behind the house, and that's going to be the first capture for them. For, uh, what's the team? I keep forgetting their name for some reason. For Control, jeez. Why do I keep forgetting that name? It's weird. All right, Rix is pulling Control's flag right now. Sun has his Hornet Overdrive, and Rix knows that. Wow, he does a great job at determining that and using his Viking Overdrive. That was an incredible job by Rix. Exclusive uses his Hunter Overdrive, but he doesn't have a repair, so Oscar... Wait, Oscar... Wait, what? Why is Oscar in now? Oh, Oscar was replaced... Or Oscar replaced Avetis for some reason. Maybe he lagged out again. That's my guess. 5-1 lead, though, for Eternity. There's not much that um, Control can do here. Not much going on yet. Um, what about the face is pushing into Eternity's base? He's going to get taken out. Um, hmm. Dude is defending a minute and a half here. Hmm. Nothing really going on. Sun has his overdrive. He's going to be able to take out Ricks. Marcos has his overdrive as well, and he turn. What about the face used his Viking overdrive? Now Tor is pulling. He uses his repair a bit early. Um, not much he could have done there. Gets his wasp bomb down, able to push some of the defenders back. Ooh, Oscar has his overdrive. Ooh, dude's gonna take him out. And that's gonna be the second flag capture for control. Um, still three flag lead. For eternity right now. Just one minute left to go. Yeah, I'm I'm calling it this is eternity's round. And they're gonna be three two lead. Ooh, chop killers helps out some grand there with the overdrive. Some grand's gonna get taken out by that fire damage, but Rix is right behind him. Rix has his overdrive as well, so this looks like a pretty successful push. <clears throat> Rix is gonna take out exclusive. Oh, exclusive gets his overdrive off. Good job by um, that hunter. All right, 40 seconds left here. Yeah, this is going to be the round. Guys, we'll go ahead and do one more form after this round, so stay tuned for that and to, for us picking the winners. Okay, looks like, yep, 15 seconds. Um, yeah, this is going to be a victory for Eternity. I guess we they're going to be picking the new map. Anyways, let's go ahead and open the form. Uh, you guys have two minutes starting now. For some reason, I keep cutting out. I don't know why. No, I'm not using voice suppression. Here, let me check my mic guys, real quick. Noise reduction. Should I turn noise reduction off? Hopefully, that'll help. 
That's my guess. All right, so I don't, next map. Oh, wow, well, yeah, I keep cutting out. I see that. That's weird. Okay, the next map is... What was that? What map did we just play? Was the Brusque? All right, next map is Red Alert. And then it's Forest after that. Forest is not that fun. I'm not gonna lie. Forest is definitely one of the most seen maps, I think, in the entire esports scene. Right. We go ahead and update the overlay. Eternity winning 3 2. And we're on to round 7. So there are four rounds left, guys. Well, that's a lot of rounds. How long have we been live for? We've been for two hours now. Depending on the rest of the rounds, guys, we may end early. Um, yeah. Can we what? Yeah. Guys, we're probably going to go ahead and end the stream after Red Alert, just because um, there's only so long that we can do a stream, and the technical difficulties really kind of put a lot of strain on us so guys two more rounds here and then we're gonna probably go ahead and end it of course there's gonna be the grand finals tomorrow so if it's a close game you guys will go ahead you guys will see who's moving on by the stream tomorrow it's just okay so we did it we got the next link so two more rounds guys then we're gonna go ahead and end it If you guys have any questions to ask me, go ahead and do them now because I'm going to be waiting for them to restart for probably a bit. I'll probably go on mute, guys, for a minute or two while I wait for the teams to reset. Just so you, you know, because I don't know what to talk about. So I'm going to go ahead and mute now. I'll be muted for about a minute.
All right, welcome back, guys. Round six has now started. Both teams have self-destruct. So Eternity is going to be on red side, and Control is going to be on blue. Oh, let's make sure the overlay is right. Yeah, no, let me switch sides. Okay, there we go. Eternity is on its right side. It's 3-2. It's going to be round seven. Sorry, not round six. If it was round six, it would still be five rounds. But yeah, round seven now. Um, Chop Kill is pushing in with Avetis. Ooh, Chop Kill gets a great Hunter Overdrive there. Oh, well, okay, never mind. Sun had a good mine placed from earlier. That was so unfortunate for Trop Killers. And then Sun also gets taken out by Avetis. Avetis doing a great job with his overdrive now. Rix gets that return. And he's going to be able to take out Tor Alpha. Or Afla. I always don't know how to say his name. Do uses his Dictator overdrive. Rix also pushing in. Oh, Avetis' overdrive runs out just last second. Not able to hit Alf Afla in time, and Afla's going to get that return. Right now, Marikos is defending on red side, and on blue side, um, the guy defending is Do. Chopkillers pushing with some grand right now. Chop Do gets a good shot on Chopkillers. Do gets Do self destructs for some reason. Sun is actually pulling the flag from Eternity's base right now. He has his overdrive as well. Okay, he just kind of... He kind of went down below. I don't know why. Oh, he's waiting for Avetis. That's why. Avetis and Chop Killer is pushing in. Avetis gets destroyed. And then what about Face? Uses his overdrive to hopefully try and take out Chop Killers. Doesn't really work there. But Sun is now going to get Chop Killers down to one shot. Oh, Chop Killers dead body. And then pushes Ricks away from the flag. Do gets a great overdrive. Sun now has his Hornet overdrive for like the fifth time already. Sun gets a good shot on Chop Killers, and now he has full health and a repair still. So now Sun's gonna push in with that uh, Magnum one shotting every single person. That Magnum is just wow. With Hornet overdrive, it's almost impossible to beat. That's just so it's so hard to beat it. Okay, right now, Misser. Oh, Misser is actually a new player for control right now. I haven't seen him in any rounds before. Oh, he gets flipped, but he drops off the flag to um, what about face? Or what about the face? That could have been a really cool play, but they got destroyed. Oh, uh, Tor Afla is lagging super badly right now. Marcos. Oh, Marcos flips Afli. He's lagging really badly. I don't know what's going on. Yeah, the the judges just told him to restart real quick Marcos trying to get this flag returned from Tor he actually did a really good job there making sure not to self-destruct and drop the flag so now the flag is still there Sun's gonna get the return and looks like the second capture for control is about to happen here both teams are just basically the same in skills so it's gonna be like this for basically the entire rest of the rounds back and forth back and forth uh, Marco's pulling Control's flag right now. He has help from Rix, and Misser is down to one shot. Marcos takes him out, but there's Sun with his overdrive. Just, wow, that's so overpowered. One-shotting almost every single person. And Dew used his Dictator overdrive. Ooh, but Sun isn't able to take out... Um, what's his name? Avetis. Marcos gets that first flag capture for Eternity. And now it's actually anyone's game. There's still six minutes left here. Both teams are playing really well. Marcos has been doing a great job at defending as well as Do has also been doing really good. Rick's pushing into the middle, gets that repair. He has his overdrive. He's probably going to use it to take out Do here. Oh uh, no, I think he's saving it for when he really needs it. I'd use it now because it's a 1v2. He needs to take out What About the Face. And he takes out Sun as well. Right before Sun can get his shot off. Um, the judges are still telling Tor Afli, or Afla to restart. He's not doing that. Okay, now he did. And there we go. Just like that, the second flag capture for Eternity. Sun almost got the kill on Marcos before he returned. Sun has that overdrive now. He's going to be tough to kill. Ooh, Marcos spawns right behind. Sun's going to be able to one-shot him. Rick's coming from behind here. Sam Grand uses his Wasp Bomb. Oh no, he doesn't. He's saving it. 
Ooh, some grand needs to hopefully get this off in time. Oh, uh, nope. Mister does a good job. Gets that third flag capture for control. Son is just wow. He able he's he's doing incredible. He's almost top on kills right now. It's just wow. With with Hornet Overdrive, Magnum is just it's almost impossible to beat in a one v one. Unless you just absolutely outplay the person. It's really hard. A vet is pushing in to Control's base. He gets taken out. Oh my gosh. Dude just keeps using his Dictator Overdrive for his entire team. Sun has his Overdrive once again. Surprised he didn't use it there to take out Semgrand. I'm guessing he's going to save it until next life. He does. Dude takes out Semgrand from blue base. Misser has that Hunter Overdrive, but he does... I don't think he has a repair yet, so he's probably going to save it. He will. There we have Sun on the left side of blue base pushing in. Let's see if he uses his overdrive yet. Maybe he's saving it until he has double damage. Uh, Chop Killers is not going to focus on him anymore. Sun able to take that one shot, and now he's just going to be able to spawn kill every single person that comes in. He's pulling the flag now. He has the overdrive. Avetis is also pulling as well with each hunter, each Hornet having their overdrive. Sun uses his repair. Avetis still has his. Exclusive is super low. Oh, good job by Avetis getting the flag capture. He knew that they'd get the return and he was just sitting there. Both teams pulling again. Exclusive is going to get taken out by Trop Killer's Hunter Overdrive. Wow, there we go. Just like that. Back to back flag captures for Eternity. And now they're going to have the 4 3 lead with just three minutes remaining. Oh, I need some water. My throat is hurting. All right, Avetis pushing in. Doesn't have his overdrive here. Maybe he can just grab that flag and make his way across. Realizes he can't. Do has that dictator overdrive again. He's going to... Uh, Do's going to give it to both. Oh, wow. He misses I exclusive. That's unfortunate. What about the faces actually pulling Eternity's flag right now? Trop Kill is trying to get the return here. Sun uses his overdrive. Rix is going to have to take him out before he can hit him. Marcos maybe get, maybe Marcos does get a free shot off on Sun. Oh, but Sun gets across the corner. Maybe Rix, he's one shot. Rix needs to get the shot. He does. Does he get the return? Wow, great return by Rix there. Chop Kill is pushing in to Control's base again. Chop Kill is going to get taken out. Um, both teams kind of pushing in here. Avetis has his overdrive. He needs to take out Sun here. He kind of just forgets about Sun because he doesn't have his overdrive. Rick's pulling the flag. The Hunter overdrive able to take out Rick's out. Chop Kill is pulling the flag now. He's going to be able to get across. Maybe he sees the repair in the middle. He does not. He doesn't go for it. He still has the repair for himself, so he's going to be all the way in Eternity's base now. And this looks like the fifth capture for Eternity. Maybe, actually, Exclusive and Sun both pushing here. If Sun has his, if Sun had his overdrive, that would have been an easy return. But now both teams are pulling. Okay, Marcos holding the flag. Misser and I exclusive both there. I exclusive gonna take up Marcos, but it doesn't matter. Chop Killers uses his overdrive. What about the face lagging on top of Chop Killers? He takes him out and gets the return there. What about the face pulling across? Now he's out of supplies. Marco spawns down. Semgrand gets the return. Wow, that was a lot of lag in there, but it ended up just being a return for both sides. Rick's pushing in with Semgrand to help. Chop Killers is also there. Semgrand taking the long way under the bridge. The only one there to defend is Dew, but Dew's going to be focused by Rick's. Oh, actually, Sun has the overdrive right now. Semgrand notices that, and he's going to drop the flag for Marikos. Oh, wow. If Sun gets the shot on Marikos, he's done for. Oh, wait. Sun's overdrive runs out. Chop Killers needs to help out Marikos. And there we go. Marikos is able to get that flag. Misser is taken out before he uses his Hunter overdrive. Dew is the only one there left to defend. Oh, wait. What about the faces actually pulling the flag? I didn't even notice that. Both teams are pulling the flag right now, and it's going to be a stalemate. Actually, Semgrand uses that Wasp Bomb. Can he take out Misser? Oh, that Wasp Bomb was poorly placed. That was unfortunate. 
Wow, both teams are in a stalemate. Sun has his Hornet overdrive. Oh, what? Okay, the time limit actually ended. I wasn't even focusing on the time. And there we go, just like that. Um, Eternity is going to be leading 4-2 on round 7. There's just 3 left. Let's go ahead and pick the winners for the last form of the day before we um, get into the last round of the day. So, guys, next round is actually... Oh, yeah, I need to give him the list, my bad. Um, next round is actually going to be our last round, guys, because... Based on the full hour of just nothing happening, my voice is hurting really badly, and um, there's just it's getting pretty drowsy. Not gonna lie. All right, list is posted. Here he's gonna go ahead and show the winners on the screen. I'm gonna get water real quick. The winners are Nickunj04, Dude Chame, and Zorthoris. Congrats to you three. Those are the last winners of today. Now let's go ahead and get into the final round of the stream. If Eternity wins this, then I'm going to call it and say Eternity is going to win the rest of the day. Actually, if they do win this, they win the entire day because. Then they'll have a three victories, and there's 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 there would only be two rounds left. Sorry, I can't say the words. All right, twenty five seconds left here. Should be f interesting. Um, I think. All right. Okay, eleven seconds left. Both teams gonna start selfing now. And like I said, if Eternity wins this, they win the day. If they tie, um, they move on. So they have to win this to win the day. All right. Avetis has his overdrive now. He has almost triple drops. Sun notices Avetis if he can get that. Nope. Okay, both Hornets are pushing in right now. Avetis decided not to use his overdrive. Smart job by him. It was a 2v1. About what about the face almost pulled that flag? Mister's also there. Mister has his hunter overdrive. Rix has his Viking. Ooh, Sun has his overdrive though. Oh, misses the shot on Marcos. Looks like he's gonna get taken out. What the hell? Trop kills is pulling the flag right now. Didn't even notice that. Sorry for saying the H word, but wow, I didn't even notice that. Um, Mister gets the return anyways. Um, Rix is actually waiting to return the flag here. Looks like he will now while exclusive pushes in. Mister gets taken out. Sun is in the middle, um, contesting Chop Killers. Sam Grand is pulling the flag right now. He has help from both Rix and Chop Killers. This looks like the first ca cap for Eternity. Uh, he's dropping it off to Rix so he can get his overdrive. There we go. First flag cap for Eternity. Good job. Rix is able to just save his overdrive till he needs it. Um, oh, able to flip Misser. Great job by Rix. He's just sitting there waiting for him to self. I think Rix has already made his mind up that he's not going to use his overdrive. So since he's already low, already used his repair, he knows he's not going to use it. Right now, Semgrand pulling the flag from Control's base. He has help from Trop Killers and Rix in the middle. Gets that wasp bomb off, able to keep all the defenders back for like three to five seconds. He's already pushing through. He has full health now. He has help from both Avet and Mar Marcos, and he gets that second flag capture for Eternity. Good job by him. He's gotten two flag caps now just by pulling the flag super quickly. Some grand team, team MVP right now. Avetis right here pushing through the middle. Doesn't have any supplies. Or overdrive. Looks like he's just doing some damage where he can. Misser is in Eternity's base right now. He has his Hunter overdrive. Not going to use it. I think he knew, knew he wouldn't make it out. 
Sun has his Hunter Hornet over. Sorry, I keep saying Hunter and Hornet. Sun uses his Hornet overdrive right now, but that means that Eternity is going to be able to push into Control's base and pull the flag. Sun is just going to. Oh wow, he somehow didn't one shot chop kill us, but he made him low enough to be taken out. And that looks like it's going to be the first capture for Control. Yeah, no one from Eternity is there. And that's going to be the first capture for Control. As we said that, Exclusive also pulling the flag, but Chop Killers with that freeze alteration, able to stop them super quickly and get that return. Chop Killers coming to help out Avet. He has his Hunter Overdrive, and Avet also has his Hornet. Avet's just going to push where he can. He's able to take out um, Sam Grand, his own teammate. That's a bit unfortunate. Um, Rick's there to help. This looks like it could be a second capture. Or the third capture. Yes, it is. There we go. Third capture for Eternity. Great job by them. Mister pulling the flag as well. He uses his repair. Chop Killers uses his Hunter Overdrive, takes them both out, and gets the return. There we go. What about the face drops the flag? He gets the return. Um, exclusive is the only one there in Eternity's base. He gets taken out. Some Grand and Avetis both pushing in to Control's base right now. Sam Grand pulls the flag, gets that wasp bomb kill on Misser. He now has help from both Ricks. He's pushing into the middle. Aw, oh, Sun flips himself. No way he takes out Chop. Oh, he's, <laughs> he somehow still took out um, Sam Grand. The flag is sitting there. Oh, no. No way they get the return here. Wow, they do get the return. That is... Jeez, I don't... Why did Sam Grand push into Sun's shot? He literally killed himself. That's, that would have been an easy cap if he just stopped driving for a second and waited for Sun to be taken out. But just like that, five minutes into the round, Eternity still leading with two flags in front. Mariko's doing a great job at defending. Ooh, Misser gets three people with that Hunter Overdrive. Chop Killers just spawns in to be able to take out Exclusive. Exclusive doesn't have double da armor, and that shows. And Chop Kill is able to take him out really quickly. Avet is actually pulling the flag right now. Misses the shot on What About the Face, and What About the Face gets the return. Some Grand pushing with Chop Killers, but Sun's going to be able to deny that pretty easily. Some Grand's going to be able to take him out. Meanwhile, Misser's actually pulling the flag right now. He gets taken out, but Sun is there. Doesn't have his overdrive. Doesn't really matter, though, because he's able to pull this flag pretty quickly. Oh, Marcos misses that shot. What the heck? Avetis is actually pulling this flag. Oh, there's the return, and Sun gets... Wait, what? Did he... he... Okay, that was just delayed. He did get the second capture. There we go, 2-3. Um, Control still needs one flag to be able to tie this up. What about the face is in Eternity's base right now? They grab the flag. Rix is going to have to use his overdrive here to get the return. There he does. He uses it. Sun gets taken out by Vettis in one shot. Dew is already low here. Sam Grand's going to be pushing in. Misser doesn't have his overdrive. If Sam Grand can use this Wasp Bomb to his advantage. Oh, he wanted to save it on my guess. Drop Kills and Rix pushing in to Control's base right now. Sun has his overdrive, which means they're going to be one shot. He's waiting for his double power before he uses his overdrive here. Ooh, what about the face uses his Viking overdrive? Mister's actually pulling Eternity's flag right now, and no one from Eternity's really spawned in, so this looks like the third capture for Control. Ooh, Avetis tried to get a cross-map shot there. Mister drops the flag off to do. Great job there, and that's going to make it tied up. Wow, Sun is just pulling that flag again. Eternity needs to get their control over. They need to spawn and get their map control again. Oh, what? Avetis doesn't do any damage with that shot. That's unfortunate. Exclusive, and what about the lose? Push, or what about the face pushing in to Eternity's base right now? Um, Misser has that Hunter Overdrive. He's going to use it now. Oh my gosh, Chop Killers gets his off right before Misser does. And there we go. There's the return. It's a tied game right now, which means that um, if they tie it, both teams will move on to round 8. Of course, this is the last round we're streaming just because it's tiresome. So, three players from Eternity pushing in to Control's base right now. Sam Grant able to take out, or Rick's able to take out Mixer. Now, Sam Grant is just pulling across the map. No one there to defend. Sam Grant's 100% going to get this cap, and that's going to be 4 3 lead for Eternity. 
If I were to turn, I'd focus on defense. Wait, what the heck? Avetis is actually pulling the flag. He has help from Semgran and Chop Killers. Chop Killers is going to grab that flag. Do not really going to be able to do much here because he's already so far. And there we go. There's the fifth capture for Eternity there. Great job. Four players from Control pushing in right now. Actually, five players. Two of them are destroyed. So now it's a... Okay, three of them are destroyed. Now it's going to be a 2v3 here. Um, exclusive needs to, is, needs to get taken out here. Sun took out Exclusive himself. Both teams are pulling the flag right now, but Sun has his overdrive. And he's going to get... No, not He's not going to get the return. Dew's actually going to be there. Chop kills, grabs the flag. Hopefully he can push off this bridge. Uh, Mr. got... Oh, wow, he didn't get flipped. Okay, both teams pulling the flag once more. Um, Dew drops the flag due to fire damage. Rix is right behind Sun. Maybe he can take him out and get this return. Sun uses his repair. Marcos with the railgun. And there we go. There's the return for Eternity. Meanwhile, on the other side... Um, both What About the Face and Exclusive were able to return the flag from Semgrand. Exclusive pulling the flag right now. Avetis has his overdrive. He just needs to hit his shot here. Great Hunter overdrive by Chop Killers, able to get that flag dropped. Waiting for the return just to make sure there's no one from Red Base um, over there in their base. Now, Chop Killers gets the return. They have a two-flag lead. This looks like it's going to be the end of the day based on if they win this round. If Attorney wins this round, it's going to be that. It's going to be the end of the day. Marcos and Rix just defending. Rix uses overdrive. 50 seconds. Doesn't look like Control can get two flags in 50 seconds. I think that's going to be it for the day then. Wow, good job. I, I thought it was going to go on forever. I'm not going to lie. But Eternity was able to win the last three rounds. G great job by them. And they were able to get the round one. Which means tomorrow, it's going to be Team Pointers versus Eternity. Ten rounds. Um, hope you guys are excited for that. 10 rounds is a lot for us, not gonna lie. 20 seconds left. 18. Sun grabbed the flag. Maybe they can make it a bit closer so it's not so much of a loss. Um, nope. Sun gets taken out by Ricks. 5 seconds left, and that's gonna be it for the day, guys. There we go, just like that. Eternity takes the day win. They're gonna be moving on to the Grand Finals versus team pointers so guys thank you so much for watching today i'm um, sorry about the technical technical difficulties earlier nothing we can really do on that it's just something unfortunate unfortunate that happens um, we don't want it to happen but sometimes it does um thank you to <clears throat> nox or casper for being the broadcaster he's been able to stick through this and we'll see you next time guys peace out